Dear parents, family and friends of Waitamela, I am Mrs. Pierce, the principal of Southern Park High School and I would like to read the following poem to you and I offer you my sincerest condolences on the passing of Waitamela. If death shall be an endless sleep, where all pressures and dreams shall cease, one would never have a need to weep lying in eternal peace. If death should bring one to the place where the spirit world resides, let us welcome then that saving grace where these spirits then abide. In death, I see no cause for fear when it comes as sweet relief. Instead, I see a cause for cheer, freed from trials and freed from grief. I would also like to end off reading from Psalm 34 verse 18. The Lord is close to the brokenhearted and saves those who are crushed in spirit. Boitomelo will be dearly missed by his friends, the school and his family. Wait, Domelo was a happy song. There was no way you could be around him and not be happy. Not once was I in trouble with him and actually felt like he was in trouble. He was positive in every situation. He felt like sunshine. A lot of people will tell you that Dumo is always in trouble. Dumo is always in a situation. True. Trouble had a way of finding him. God knows trouble had a way of finding him. But once he was in it, he found his way out of it. My best friend was an amazing person, always smiling, always showed compassion, effortlessly towards all living things. His warmth filled the rooms ever so easily every time he walked in. How could we forget his grateful presence? To our beloved classmate, friend, brother, and son, Rest in eternal peace, Marilam. Good morning, everybody. It's Mrs. Engelbrecht, grade 8 of grade 12 at Sunwood Park High. Dear parents, family and friends, it's with a heavy heart that I have to sit here today to pay tribute to one of my children. Boy Tumelu, you'll be remembered for your kindness and caring, especially towards staff members like Mr. Atikia and myself. You got your angel wings far too early, son. But God chose you for his garden. Your work on earth was done according to him. I know in your own hearts, we don't feel that that was fair. But God's time is not ours. He will live on in our hearts forever. Your place on earth will be empty, but never in our hearts. May your soul rest in peace. And may you spread your wings, your angel wings, 
over us and protect us always. Father, we come to you in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, you are our Father, the Father who is so compassionate. You have given us a gift of blooming. Today, we are honoring you, Lord, and we are giving all the thanks to you because, Father, you are worthy to be praised. We thank you, Lord, for this life. We thank you, Lord, for borrowing us such a good soul. Bless this family. Bless Sanot Park High School family, the SNT, the teachers, the students, the ground staff, everyone that met to me. And Lord, bless this family. Comfort them. Give them strength. Give them courage. Let them know that you are God. Let them know that, Father God, those who trust in you, you will never put to shame. Let them know that, Father God, you are a compassionate father. There's nothing too hard for you. Jeremiah say, Ah, Lord God, you have made the heaven and earth with your outstretched arm. Is there anything too hard for you? This situation is hard, but it is not hard for God. Father, we give you all the honor. We give you all the glory. Bless this sermon. Bless each and every one. Protect us, my father, as we go in our different Yeah.